Ready to go pumpkin picking, Dylan? Three, two, one. It's pumpkin time! Oh, <laughs> I think you're supposed to push it forward. <laughs> Say good morning. Well, that is just rude. <laughs> Dylan is not a morning dog. Dylan, we're going pumpkin picking today. Are you excited for that? I'm excited. Yes, you are, aren't you? Now we're only taking Dylan. We're not taking Belle. Belly. Belle. I'm sorry, we're leaving you behind today just because I don't think I can handle two of you plus pumpkins. So we're just going to take the little one. Sorry if I've just scared the absolute life out of you, but this isn't my Halloween costume. This is actually a face mask because today I am doing a daily vlog, which you've probably already seen by the title, but this is going to be a really, really autumnal vlog. I've just lost my top lip, so I'm just going to get that back. Okay, that's a bit better. Um, so today I'm going to do the most autumnal vlog with the dogs and with my friend and we're going to be going over to the mainland. I live on the Isle of Wight so we have to get on a ferry to go over to the mainland to go pumpkin picking which I just can't wait for. So I thought this morning because we don't have to go over until I think it's like, um, I think we're booked at like five o'clock in the evening to go because we wanted it at sunset because I just thought it'd be amazing at sunset. Um, so we're not getting the ferry until three o'clock so I've got all morning to just kind of like chill and I thought I'd give myself a little pamper with this face mask which I'm just absolutely loving like it just stay the bottom bit is slipping obviously because I'm talking but if you don't talk it just stays in place and it's like much nicer than these other masks that I've tried this is like two separate ones so yeah I'm really enjoying it I will have a video up I think it's like next week or something um talking about all these products because they're all korean products so i think you've probably had enough of looking at me like this so i'm just going to get on with my morning and then i will update you if i'm doing anything remotely interesting until we actually end up going pumpkin picking which i can't wait for i'm so so excited so if you do enjoy the video you definitely give it a thumbs up and i really really hope that you enjoy coming along on my very very autumnal day with me today okay so i'm now going to do a little bit of editing i filmed a shein haul yesterday so i need to edit that video and start putting it together so i thought the perfect time to do that is when i've got my face mask on um and yeah let me show you some of the stuff actually honestly i think it's one of like my favorite hauls this is um hang on let me just show you what they look like because honestly i feel like they were like really really nice um leather lit leggings and then this video will already be up actually so you can go and check it out properly but i'll just give you a quick um like idea of what the stuff was like and then this was like a co-ord set look how nice that is i just like absolutely love it it's like a very autumnal haul I'm 
looking a little bit more put together now. I'm all ready to go. It's about an hour before we're going to be probably leaving. So I'm just going to finish up getting ready, deciding what I'm going to wear on my feet because the weather is so bad that this pumpkin patch is literally just going to be a field of mud and pumpkins. So I need to give my wellies a good like clean and then I'm going to take them, cleaning them because there's probably a load of spiders in them, not because they're muddy, because obviously they're just going to get muddy again. So this is my chosen pumpkin picking outfit. Not that you're really going to see it because it's going to be covered in probably a big coat, but this is um, from the haul I was just showing you actually on Shein. Um, this is one of the dresses that I did pick up from there and I just absolutely love it. It's kind of like this cable knit, um, comfy, cosy jumper dress with a tie around the middle. And yeah, it's just really nice. It's a really nice length as well. I've just popped on with a pair of tights. So yeah, I need to go and clean my wellies. Oh, so excited. Not long. Um, I've done some nice autumnal makeup. Let me show you. This is my autumnal makeup. I've just done like a nice orangey colour with like a orange shimmer in the middle so yeah I think it looks like pretty good for autumn and then I just put a few curls through my hair to like make a bit of an effort as we're actually going out and doing something so I'm really excited about that so the next clip you'll probably see is maybe like I was getting on the ferry or something like that and then um yeah on our way to pumpkin picking right we are waiting for the boat now and we've got the doggies in the back let's see them oh hang on sorry just ignore it. how rude <laughs> <laughs> this is Emma. More importantly. <laughs> yeah, more importantly. This is Emma. Hi. And this is Oscar, Emma's pug. Look Say at hi, Oski. Hello, Oscar. Such a handsome boy. Oh. And then we've got Dylan, who looks extremely moody in the back there. Oh no, he looks a bit more chill. Hard now. life. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, they're all right. They'll be fine. Oh, I think, started raining. Yeah, the weather. Oh my god. <laughs> Not the best Yay. pumpkin weather. You can just about see the ferry through there. That's what we've got to get on because to do anything interesting, yeah, anything interesting on this island, you have to go on the ferry to go and um, do something. Fun stuff. So yeah, we're going to get on the ferry now and hope that this rain stops. Although sometimes I find the rain just in patches and then, Definitely. yeah. <laughs> well, hopefully just on the island. Fingers crossed. Um, we've got a welly. Oh no, you haven't got wellies. Have you? I've got like grubby shoes, literally. <laughs> They're trainers. Yeah, but they are grubby. Like. <laughs> oh well, it'll be fine. So we'll probably see you when we're on the way, traveling there somewhere along the way. Stop the is it? Then. Yeah. <laughs> if that makes any sense. sunset but actually uh, it's dark now so we had to stop for food but it does still look quite pretty and it's all lit up here so I think it's gonna be so much fun pumpkins and wheelbarrows everywhere Dylan excited doggies ah. <laughs> oh my. are you okay my I'm not gonna help you I'm just gonna film you <laughs> Maybe put your, you could put your tripod in it. <laughs> well done. Never done this before. Well, it's really fun. It suits you actually. <laughs> I think you're supposed to push it forward. <laughs> I think Oscar's scared of it, so I'm not. Oh. That's okay. Oscar's right. really scared. Why has it only got one wheel? That's it. Oh, oh yeah, no. They... <laughs> right, there is the giant pumpkin. This place has been on the news like for the last couple of weeks. Which oh no, there's even a shop here. Oh my god, it's so cute. So it's been on the news because of this giant pumpkin, which is apparently the second ever biggest fruit that's grown in second largest fruit that's been grown on the planet. Wow. How 
how fun is this? It's very muddy. I'm glad I've got my wellies on, <laughs> unlike Emma. Right, we'll leave it set up there. <laughs> Look, you really, really should have put wellies on. Oh my god. <laughs> Help. <laughs> Stop. Right. Uh, we'll leave that there. Right, I did not think it would be this muddy. Why do they not show pictures of this? Yeah, they left it when it's. Everywhere. I'm mad. <laughs> Whose fun idea was this? Not mine. <laughs> right. So our little plan is we're going to take loads of pumpkins and pile them up around this like thing here or whatever it is, it's like a pole, and then take some pictures. We've tied the dogs on there because they're like a bit of a nightmare and it's just so muddy. Can you see this? the whole field is just like a mud bath and as you can see everyone else is like in the clean area and we've decided to come out onto the field because obviously we wanted to do the real thing. Oh, oh, there there maybe there might have been a slight one. Oh, I'm going to do my shirt up so Oh no. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, look at those pumpkins. <laughs> Just wanted to film the moon. <laughs> what happened? Just put my finger in there. <laughs> look, it's like a massive arm. <laughs> <laughs> I just put my finger right in the hole. <laughs> they are a bit manky now, aren't they? I think we're a bit late to the yeah, game. These are the skanky ones because they were fun. Should we make it look like casual? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, you're you filming? No. What, well, do you think I'd make it too? <laughs> no, I didn't go across the Oh my God, I thought you fell over. <laughs> oh, I'm going to film as well. Oh, maybe I'll film on... <laughs> oh, I'm going to try filming... ...and separate. <laughs> <laughs> Dylan, you're the pumpkin king. Dylan is amazing. He's just staying so still. I think he's happy having his feet off the mud. Oh, he's so good. But <laughs> Could you not pick that up? <laughs> it's a good one. <laughs> Oh my 
god, we have found the cutest restaurant. Happy mm. Halloween. So cute. And then all the little pumpkins on the table. Why are you so cute? Yeah, you're matching. Oh, here's your food. Thank you. Oh, that looks amazing. <laughs> I'll get some Thank you. Um, I'm okay, thank Can you. I get some salt and vinegar? Thank you. Oh my goodness. That, that is fine, good. thank you. Oscar, do you like the look of that steak? Some steak for a ski. Some steak. We are back on the ferry now. We finished our lovely autumnal day. I hope that you enjoyed coming along with us on the day. I'm going to insert some clips in now of what I'm going to do with the pumpkins because my plan is to make some pumpkin soup and then carve them up. So I'm going to do that and then that's going to be on a different day, obviously. So then I'm going to insert that now. Hopefully it goes to plan. <laughs> yeah. If it doesn't and I just go on to the next <laughs> yeah, clip, then you know it didn't go to plan. <laughs> But yeah, I thought I'd just show you that way because I'm not going to be doing that tonight because it's like 10 o'clock now and I just want to go to bed. I'm actually really tired. Are you tired? Oh, I'm knackered. Yeah, it was quite a long day. Okay, so pumpkin carving time. This is the bit that I've been waiting for. I hope you've been waiting for. I have picked, I feel like, four good pumpkins. I've got a large one, a medium and a small one. And then this like greeny blue one, which is just like really, really cute. Um, so I think, oh, and I also picked up this like carving kit. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is carve this one, this big one, because I really love it. Like, it's just like, look at it. It's like the perfect pumpkin. So I want to carve that one. And... I think with these two, I'm going to like make something out of them. So I'm not going to do anything with them today. I'm going to like probably make a soup, but I'm not going to put that into this vlog because I honestly don't know what I'm doing and it's just going to be a messy vlog. So I thought let's just stick with the carving and do this one. And then also I want to carve this one, but I'm just going to make this like really like aesthetically pleasing. So all I'm going to do with this one is like cut the top off it and then scoop everything out and then just poke like holes through it, like little circles. So then when you put a candle in it, it just has like all these little sprouts of light coming out of it. And I just think that'll look really pretty. And then with this one, now I am the least artistic person ever. So this is gonna be a challenge for me. But for this one, I really wanted to do this design here. So I'm going to give that a go. I'm really excited to do it. I think what you have to do first is like cut the top off, obviously, so you can scoop everything out, which I'm going to get Ollie to do that because I honestly, I don't even know how I'm going to get through it, but we're going to give it a go anyway. And also I made a little order from the Cakesmith, who is a baker near where I live. And I just want to open that up on camera because it's just absolutely gorgeous. I'm just pouring it everywhere, but this is how it comes boxed. And then when you open it up, it's just filled with Halloween treats. So we have got in this box, this little marshmallow, which is like a ghost. We have some brownies here, which I think are like chocolate orange and something else. Um, we have a Lotus Biscoff brownie there. We have another blondie here, which is like a white chocolate blondie there. And then we have all these really cute little sweets, like Halloween sweets, scary chocolate lolly, um, little lolly here with these little pumpkins on it. Really, really cute. I'm so happy with it. So these are what I'm going to be munching on tonight whilst my pumpkins are burning away in the background. So I'm hoping for a really, really cute Halloween evening. I can't wait for it. So anyway, let's get on to carving these pumpkins. Right, so 
Ollie actually sawed the pumpkin, which is very handy we are renovating our house because we do have saws laying around everywhere because there was no way a knife was gonna really cut through this. So yeah, he sawed it off. But I reckon he's actually sawed maybe like too much here off. Um, so it hasn't really left me with much there, but anyway, that's fine. Um, oh my God, you wanna look inside it? It actually smells so nice and fresh. This is what it looks like inside. And now I'm gonna open up my pumpkin carving kit. And I'm just gonna like start scooping out all of the stuff inside here and just put it into this bowl. I don't know, I've got this thing here, but I don't know if it's that good. Oh my god, do you know where to just pull it out? Oh. Not really sure how you're supposed to get it all out. I'm just kind of pulling it now. Like that spoon didn't do anything. I don't know how you're supposed to get it out. I saw something in the I put like a whisk in there. A whisk? Oh uh, yeah, use the um, whisk, Rosie. What whisk? Our whisk we've got. Electric whisk? Yeah, apparently that works. Really? Okay. Well, it's going to get all the stringy bits out. I think so. <laughs> oh my god, you took my hand <laughs> off! You <missed> that one. <laughs> right, yeah. hang on, we need to explain what we're doing now. Well, so, I saw it on, um, on Facebook, I think. Ollie yeah. saw on Facebook that apparently if you put a whisk, electric whisk in here, don't try this at home. Um, it picks up all the things that... So yeah, look. Oh, no, it is actually working. So now he's cut it all. You can literally just pick it out. Put it in there. There you go. Go on then. Which is a pretty face. No, you're not. Oh, that's so satisfying. <laughs> oh, is there with this it? bloody thing? I was trying to <laughs> scoop <look> at this. <laughs> okay, hey, thanks. Okay, so that saved a lot of time. Well done, Ollie. He's right, not just a pretty face. Well, I have to say, Ollie is a bloody genius because that has just saved me. It literally took like three minutes, I'd say. So here is my huge bowl of like pumpkin insides. And then my pumpkin is all nice and cleared out, ready for carving. This side is all a bit manky, so we're gonna carve on this side here where it's all like nice. So basically, you need a Sharpie or some kind of pen, it's like draw your design on here, and then you just need to, like, I don't know, draw your design on there, I guess, so you know, like you've got to cut out around the design. So I'm probably gonna block the whole camera while I do this. I'm gonna do this and then I'll show you it after I've drawn it, I think it'll be easier. Okay, so I've drawn my design onto the pumpkin. I mean, I don't know, I don't think it's too bad. I really struggled with the Sharpie on the pumpkin. I think because my pumpkin was a bit wet because I washed it, I couldn't get it to like draw on there. So dry your pumpkins first. But I mean, you would have already done the pumpkins by the time you wash this anyway. Um, yeah, so I think it's gonna turn out okay. It doesn't look great now, but I think it's when, it's all done, isn't it? That's when you know. Right, let's get my little, uh, this little thing, which is um, a pumpkin carver. And I wanna make sure I carve the right bits. So I think this is where you could go wrong. You could carve the wrong bits of the pumpkin. So I'm gonna start up here. And, oh my God, oh, there we go, we're going through. 
Oh, this is so hard to see the first bit. I have cherry pie here, guys, for better. So just carve along the line. The thing is, I'm leaving kind of like the black marker on the pumpkin, which I don't really... Oh, no, I'm not. Because that bit will be gone, in it? Yeah, I see. Oh, my God. I hope you can see what I'm doing, but I'm literally just like carving along here and then checking where I'm carving because I need to be very careful. Okay, I'll come back when I've got a little bit further along the process. Okay. This is my car crash of a pumpkin. Uh, oh, this was really hard to do. It's taken me absolutely ages and it still doesn't look good. That's the dogs fighting, by the way. I mean, maybe it's gonna look okay when I've actually like put the candles in it. So like I was saying, I will insert a clip of this later on tonight to show you what it's looking like. Um, but yeah, that's, that's my pumpkin. And you know what, I think with these ones, I'm going to leave them alone and just put them next to this one and have them decorated. But this is like the one with the decorations in it because I just, I can't ruin another one of these poor pumpkins. So I will insert that clip now. mentioned a few videos before but Emma has a YouTube channel as well which is called The Handsome Pugs and you can see a lot more from Emma and then you can also and see more boys. from the lovely handsome boys which is Oscar just peeking through there and then also Henry who is another pug they're both rescue pugs and they're just absolutely gorgeous so definitely go over yeah <laughs> and check out Emma's channel and I will link that down below and also she has a couple of Instagram pages which oh I'll link so many down Instagram below. pages yeah you're very very <laughs> good with the Instagram. Like fill up your comment section. Yeah I'm really terrible with Instagram. I need to get more on that but anyway I'll leave all of our stuff linked down below and yeah I really really hope you enjoy the video. So if you did enjoy the video please give it a thumbs up and definitely subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more. Um, I would love to do more vlogs but I do film a lot of like clothing hauls and like product testing and stuff like that so if you do enjoy stuff like that definitely subscribe as well i hope you're having a lovely day whatever you are up to and hopefully i will see you in the next video bye 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 doggies you're so tired so cute